Hey guys, it's Dark with Cyclone FPV, and I am getting ready to do a quick video here. I'm going to set the screen up real quick for you guys. So on one side, we're going to have, um, uh, let me see if I can do this right. Bam, there we go. Okay, so what we've got here is, I'm using an HDLRC Zeus as an example, um, but uh, I'm going to brick this board, or basically uh, kind of interrupt the flashing of it with the new firmware. And what you're going to see is this constant red light then on here. And I'm seeing there are some people that have a, a question about this. So I'm going to show you one way to go ahead and uh, unbrick this and get it back to working again. Okay. But to do that, I've got to show you what happens on the uh, computer as well. So I'm going to go ahead and open up. Um, I'm going to open up uh, Betaflight here in just a second. But the first thing I need to do is I am going to uh, try to replicate um, what's happening here. So. We know that on the, let me do this real quick here. So uh, there we go. Okay, so here's, here's my uh, uh, flight controller and I'm just gonna go ahead. I was putting in the, intentionally putting in the wrong firmware to uh, mess with it. Um, and so I'm just gonna go ahead and flash it, uh, reflash it with the newest firmware real quick. So bear with me one second. I need to clean up around here. It's been a little crazy. So let's go ahead and while we're waiting, we can clean up. Okay, so it's gonna go through the erasing process, obviously. And uh, we're just gonna let that keep happening here. It should be done here in just a second. And once that's done, we can get going to the, uh, we're gonna intentionally mess it up and, um, and then show you how to fix that, okay? So let's see, let's get all this stuff out of the way. All right, it's almost done. Now this will apply to most boards, um, and if you happen to have a board and you think you've bricked it or done something wrong to it, please let me know. It doesn't have to be an HDLRC. I've got a thousand flight controllers in stock here, so I probably have the one you have, or if not, I have something similar, so at least we can try it. Okay, so um, we can see now when I go to connect, right, I've got everything here, and if we go to our CLI, let me move this out of the way here and just type real quickly. So if we go to our CLI and I type the word version, we can see that we're running Omnibus F4 4.0.3, which was released in June, okay? Now, here's what we wanna do. So I'm gonna click Disconnect. Whoops, sorry, just dropped my keyboard. I'm gonna click Disconnect, and I'm gonna go to Firmware Flasher, and I'm gonna select something like, um, uh, I don't know, I'll pick a random one, okay? And I'm gonna click to go ahead and load the firmware, and, um, and then flash it, right? Now watch what I'm gonna do here. So it's gonna go, this one's gonna go to DFU mode and uh, it's gonna reset itself here. Now you can watch the light on the board. I'm gonna get picked up my keyboard, I think I broke it. Oh, my Lego guy saved it. All right, thanks dude, fell on his head. Okay, so we're gonna flash it here, right? And then in the middle of flashing, I'm gonna disconnect it. Now this is like the worst thing to do. It's one of the worst things to do. You don't really wanna do that. Um, but here's what's gonna happen next. Now when I plug it in, um, I'm gonna get this solid red light and you're gonna see nothing in beta flight here, okay? Like it doesn't even recognize that I've plugged it in, all right? Um, and so I'm gonna do it again, all right? And I'm gonna go ahead and plug it in and you're gonna see the screen does nothing, okay? So here's what you're gonna do in this case, right? In this case, you're gonna flip the Zeus over, uh, oh no, sorry, actually right here on this board, let me zoom in a little bit. Right, it's gonna be a little blurry, I guess, but right there, uh, this little gold button right here, you're gonna go ahead and press that down and while you're holding it, uh, now I need to zoom out, sorry. So let me zoom out, because I know now you can't see anything else that I'm doing. While you're holding that button, keep it pressed, that gold button, go ahead and plug in your USB and watch my screen. All, all of a sudden I'm in DFU mode, and in DFU mode, I can go back, scroll up. Uh, hold on, I may have to uh, close this real quick. Let me just close it and open it back up. And I'm in DFU mode, and I'm gonna go ahead and go to my firmware flasher, and I'm gonna drop down to Omnibus if my computer will cooperate. Omnibus, this is just gonna be the regular F4. And I'm still gonna pick the newest version and I'm gonna leave it as full chip erase. And I'm just gonna say load firmware. And then I'm gonna click flash firmware. It's gonna automatically start erasing. And you can see the solid red light is here still. And now it's gonna go through the flashing. Now, in some cases, when you do certain boards, 
unbricking them is, is very difficult. Um, it, you, it requires a third party software in some cases, not some, these are older boards, but I've been, uh, I've done those and I've got videos on those as well that I'm gonna get done for some of you, but most people aren't using those boards anymore. I do, because I'm old and old school. But um, just keep in mind that this is how you're gonna work on the Zeus board and considering that the Zeus was the one in question. And if you look now at my beta flight screen, I'm back to using comp port three, I can click connect and there's my stuff, okay? So hopefully that will, um, Hopefully that'll help you guys. All right, guys, that's it. It was a quick video just to show you guys how to unbrick the Zeus. Uh, and it will apply to your other boards as well, to most of them. So try that first. If you have any questions, let me know what board you've got. And look, you don't have to have bought it from here. This isn't a, oh, if you don't buy from me, I can't help you. Please, we're all here to help each other. So let me know what you got, okay? And I'll help you out as best I can. All right, guys, safe flying. God bless. And we will talk to you soon. Bye.